What's going on guys? In this video, in this video, in this video, uh, you're gonna see me uh, struggle. <laughs> struggle, I'm changing my, ooh, my top water plugs, uh, Miradines, uh, from treble hooks to single inline hooks, and I've struggled. And I'm gonna show you the struggle, but also I'm gonna show you once I got it, I got it. Once I got it, I got it. So lesson learned, fail, 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 mess up, mess up, mess up, mess up, succeed. <sighs> fail, 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 succeed. <sighs> succeed, 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 succeed. So you gotta fail a little bit before you succeed. So don't worry about it, all right? And today we're doing something brand new. I am going to attempt <laughs> to change my treble hooks from my top water lures to single inline hooks uh, like you see here. And <clears throat> uh, you see here, I don't like having treble hooks on these lures. I like the single inline. We want to give this a try and see if I can um, do the same thing. Um, I have a bunch of top water lures that I haven't used yet. <clears throat> and I wanted to go ahead and um, change them and see if I can be effective because I have not caught fish off of top water lures. And that's my goal this fall is to do that. And so what I have is a couple different kind of hooks. Owner, <clears throat> one odd hooks and two odd hooks. And I have a VMC in line that's a one aught, a one aught hook. And I also have mirror lures, one aught and two aught. I'm going to compare the one aughts and see, um, compare the one aughts and see if they're the same, same size. So let's take a look at the one aught, because the one aughts are going to go on to my smaller, um, mirror lures okay for trout fishing so this is the owner and notice the the distance of how wide it is and from what <clears throat> what I was um, told was that what you do is take a look at the treble hook and look at the width of the treble hook and that should be about the same width as your um, as your, your inline. All right, this is the one aught mirror lure, right? And here's the one aught owner. That owner hook can fit in. The owner hook can fit in between, even though both of them are one aught. So this one aught is about the same size. Looks like it's the same size as this. Yeah, this is a one odd as well. And it's the same size. So I kind of like the smaller hook, the owner smaller, the smaller hook with, with the owner for the smaller lures. So um, I'm gonna try that. All right, let's give it a try. So I have these snips and it has like this little um, tooth on it that allows you to get the split rings off. I'll take the hooks out. Um, some suggestions were to cut the barb first. I'm not gonna do that. Let me see if I can do it without doing that. Ooh, that worked pretty well. Wow, look at that. Uh oh, I actually bent it. <clears throat> All right, <clears throat> so what I have to do is take the uh, treble hooks off. And one good thing you can do is just snip these, snip the points off. 
might make it a little bit easier for you to uh, take take it off. And it doesn't go all the way in. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. So I learned something. Let's use the bigger one. Let's try that one. Okay, that seems to work. At least it opened it up. Now, how do I get it out? That's, that's the next question. Hmm. Like I said, this is my first time doing this, so I'm taking you guys along with me. I guess I could just use my nail, right? I need a nose ply. Oh, there we go. It's off. Hey, hey. It's off, it's off, ladies and gentlemen. This is a tool I'm not used to using, that's for sure. But I'm gonna figure it out. You better believe that, buddy. You better believe it. I'm gonna figure it out. Nope. Let's see here, maybe. Grab it right there. Twist it. <laughs> hmm. See, see that? Oh. I know some of you guys are going, dude, you're taking too long for this. <laughs> I get it. I'm new to it, so I'm, I'm letting you go, go through what I'm going through. <laughs> but I'll get better. I ain't worried about that. Screwdriver. Ugh. All right, let's see. This is taking too long. Hold on, let me just snap this other sucker off. Excuse me. <laughs> snap this off. Ah. Ah. Oh, that didn't work. Let's try right here. Ah. That didn't work. Jeez, not as strong as I used to be. all this out but I don't want to so you have to bear with me. Alright. Got it. Oh yeah 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 here it comes. Come on. Woohoo Woohoo Grab that and bring it around. Done. Oh my goodness the learning curve trash can alright as you can see, I'm struggling. I'm struggling. So let's go ahead and fast forward to when I got it. Let's go. All right. So I just did this one. I wasn't recording because I went on um, YouTube and found a guy that, that, that actually saw a strong video on how to make it even easier because I kept messing up the direction of the hooks. So this one, this one worked. So I'm going to... Do the same thing with this silver one. This has a lot of rattle in it. I can't wait to put the black hooks on this one. And uh, you guys can come with me when I do this one. That way I don't poke myself. That's one. Two. Three. Do the same for this one. As you're taking this one off, you're going to put the hook on at the exact same time. That's going to save you a lot of time, which I wasn't doing before. So, like I said, learn something each time. Here we go. So, first of all, I got to get this one off. And these are a bigger lure, so my split ring pliers did work to get me the first step of uh, opening that thing up. My problem was I had my split rings 
pliers were too big for the lure that I was working with. So that goes on right away, just like that. Right. And so all I want to do is make sure that this is facing backwards and that's all I need to do. And it should, it should work. Well, I'm just facing backwards, which it is. It's on there. And as I rotate it, the treble hook is going to come off. That was quick, wasn't it? That was quick. Doing the exact same thing with the front. I'm just gonna make sure that the um, the hook is facing forward. Show it's facing forward, which is this direction right here. Hopefully that's it.
Oh man, look at that. Hey. There we go. There we go. This was this was gonna catch something. I, I I have a feeling that this one's gonna catch something. This black looks just like a, this looks just like a uh, mullet coming through. All right, so I got those done, and I think that's about it. I had, do have this lure right here. This one's supposed to be. It has a nice little rattle to it too. Took me a while to figure out how to do it, but I uh, got it down. I could get them get them done in no time at all. So let's uh, line these guys up. This one right here. So there you have it. Until next video, be blessed you guys.